Hi, I'm Jasmine with Jasmine Panama Jewelry. Thanks for joining me today on the Reconstruction Zone. So today, since I'm just a few months away from my own little girl, I decided to be a fun DIY project to go ahead and do something for a little girl. So join me today and figure out how to make a fun, cute barrette for your little girl. So materials that we're gonna need today are gonna be barrette clips, which you can get at Michael's. And then whatever you're gonna to wanna to put on your barrette. I'm gonna do some fun studs, some rhinestones, and taking some chain from a leftover necklace, or you can just buy some chain. And then for small barrettes for little girls, you can also buy these bobby pins that have the small little circles on the end of it that you can glue things on. And then I think we'll probably do a couple of little roses. You can always get buttons that you have. And in order to do the buttons, if they have anything on the back here, you'll just get something from the bead shop in order to clip that off. And then if you're gonna end up doing the chain, then you'll go ahead and get two of the pliers that you'll probably already have around the house if you're doing around some jewelry. Lastly, we'll need our trusty scissors to do the cutting. And then for all the gluing, we'll need our glue sticks. And of course, our hot glue gun. So the first thing that we're gonna do is one of the barrettes. The barrette is gonna be simple. We have these great little bobby pins and we already have a flat surface on it that's gonna make it super simple to apply any of these things onto it. For this, because we have such a large flower, if we do a little more, it doesn't even matter so we can get as messy as we need to. And just apply. And then as soon as that dries, you'll have a cute little barrette. You can also do these, like I was saying before, with buttons. Buttons are gonna be super simple. Again, if you go over to Michael's, you can get one of these bobby pins that are gonna have a flat surface on it. It's gonna make it simple to apply any of these things onto it. Just take any of the buttons that you have around the house that are decorative. If you do have any of these buttons on the back end of it, you're gonna to wanna to clip this in order to make this surface flush. All right, and then all we're gonna do is get a little baby dot of glue from our glue gun. And stick it to the back of the button. So in the end, you're gonna get something like this, and you can do endless and endless different types of designs, so your little girl can have new little bows every day. So the next thing that we're gonna do are the barrettes, and what we're gonna end up having is the barrette that we're gonna get from Michaels, all bare, but just a little clip that you would normally have for little girls. And I'm gonna end up doing the rhinestone. You're gonna end up just taking this and seeing exactly how much it's gonna cover the top of your barrette. Eyeball that to cut it. And then we'll simply take our glue gun again, line the whole entire thing, and be careful because this is hot. And simply stick this on. align it in order to make sure this is nice and straight and put it down to dry and then here we have our finished project we have our studs our rhinestones and then our chain and then feel free to go ahead and experiment a little bit more if your little girl loves flowers you can do a lot more florals you can do it with leather or even with bows this will be a fun and easy project you guys can both even do it together